All right, I'm just videoing this just so I can capture the whole thing. <clears throat> this is a whole new technique and this is on the big mirror which I did the other day on video and I scraped it because it cracked because it was a windy hot day and, and the top colour dried too quickly. So I pulled all the paint off so that because this was a new whole new technique I didn't tape this how I did this one but I will tape another one on a smaller tile so that you can actually see it how it's done really beautifully um, now what I did with this and you'll see some straight colors there like there a straight color or over there straight color underneath I poured the pillow to around about a quarter of the way in the center of the mirror and then I drizzled all the colors on all the acrylics and pigments and all the various colors and then I stretched the pillow right out and the colors right out so it was dripping off the edge so there's very very little pillow left and then what I did was I used, because there's very little pillow, very little colour left. Most of it had all been, been tipped off. So it's a very light layer of pillow and colour. And then I used just a, just a, a um, business card. So this one's a little bit bigger to get some of the big stripes out from the centre. Dipped it in the cell activator. There was my cell activator. Dipped it in and just pulled very gently. Now the reason we use a card because it's not as thick as normal and um, it um, is a lot lighter to pull. And then what I did was I used a smaller card, business card, like a really little normal size business card. And when I did this, I'm gonna try and get that. Okay, when I did this, I dipped it in the cell activator and then gently put it down and swiped. So you can only do that like with a small tool, hence getting the little, the little effects. But I thought it looked more like a, um, like a um, oh, Aboriginal art piece. <laughs> It actually does look more like an Aboriginal with the dot paintings. Uh, but when Chris saw it, he thought it looked more aztec -y, like a sundial. So there you are. I will do a how-to video. Absolutely adore the colours in it. So it's the, um, it's the cayenne, the uh, t um, marine blue, light blue, gold, bronze and interference gold very shimmery you can't really see it but very shimmery so because this is a lot thinner I and and it's a rainy day cold day today I anticipate that this will not crack and separate because um, there's not a thick pillow underneath it so guys a whole new technique stay tuned I will do the how to create it on a much smaller tile, maybe not with the same colours, um, and show you how it's done. Stay tuned, stay safe, take care of yourselves, bye for now.